tonight at the jail with the first interview. How? Chris Tony Lovato was released from jail here in Van Nuys around 6 o'clock tonight. He was subdued. He had little to say. He was clearly glad to be out of jail. He spoke with us for this story you'll see only on Fox. Arriving at his apartment in an entourage of SUVs, Tony Lovato was again a free man after three days in jail. How you doing? Um, not doing too good. Just had the hardest three days of my life. This was Lovato not long after getting out of jail. This is the way he looked, his hair dyed blonde, as the lead singer of the punk rock group Mess. Sunday, he was arrested for suspicion of murder, taken into custody for stabbing to death a 25-year-old man named Wayne Hughes during a fight in the parking garage of his Studio City apartment complex. But the district attorney decided not to file charges against Lovato, who's still showing signs of that run-in on Sunday, a black eye. The shiner, uh, is that from the fight? Yeah. You, As for dropping this case, Sandy Gibbons with the district attorney's office says, we determined that the suspect and victim had dated the same girl back and forth for over a year. Gibbons says there have been threats, and the victim sent several threatening messages to the suspect. Apparently, she says, there was some mutual combat, and Lovato attempted to separate himself from the victim when the victim challenged him to a fight. The victim followed Lovato to an isolated spot in the underground garage and tried to fight him. Lovato defended himself, and there was insufficient evidence to show it was not a justifiable use of reasonable force in self-defense. Lovato's reaction? I'll comment on that on Friday. On Friday, when he says he'll make a full statement. For now, he says he's okay. Um, as good as I could be. Not exactly clear what Lovato plans to say on Friday, but for now, he tells me he's just a, appreciative of his family and friends and fans who have stood by him. Reporting live from Van Nuys, Hal Eisner, Fox 11 News.